Ain't nothing going on today but a bomb seafood boil with a bomb sauce. Stay tuned, y'all. What's going on, my YouTube family? On the men you today, we are having a seafood boil. <laughs> so, y'all, let me stop playing. I'm sorry. All right, so we are having a seafood boil, y'all. I got some king crab. I got some snow crab. I got some. I love these potatoes in my seafood boil. The sunrise metwe. They are so sweet and delicious. We have some uh, raw shrimp here. Some nice big ones. We got us uh, some turkey kielbasa that we go fry up. We got some nice sweet um, fresh corn on the cob. What else is under here? Nothing much. Um, oh man, that shrimp just. That shrimp just, uh, that shrimp just busted through the, uh, it's a sharp piece of that shrimp, um, coming through the bag that just almost pierced my skin. We got our eggs. We got our beef broth. We have some nice, healthy butter. Um, we have some brown sugar, and we have some minced ginger, and we also have some garlic roasted garlic i love using the roasted garlic um for my boils it's so good and we have our ginger um over here we have uh, some very very hot hot to water baby hot to water and we are going to season our water with some slap your mama some old bay and some adobo so i'm going to Put the seasonings over here in this large pot. I am going to clean up my seafood very well. Wash your seafood jaw. Stop playing and wash your seafood. Don't just bust it out the pack, run it under some water, and then throw it in a pot. Wash your seafood. Quit playing. So, let's get this seafood nice and washed up. Let's get this corn um, nice and washed up because you know I'd be having those... Uh, this is already shut, so it'll still be having those strings and stuff on it. That's so annoying, but I love this fresh corn. Um, let's just get everything washed up, y'all, and I'll be back to show y'all the next step. Bye. Okay, my YouTube fam, so now it is time to wash our seafood and wash our veggies up real good. So this is what I'm talking about. Don't just grab your bag of potatoes, cut them open, and throw them in your pot with your seasoned water or whatever because you're going to run into some that look like this see, focus see that see this now this is why you got to check all your food see don't nobody want to eat that this is why you got to check all your food and make sure you cleaning all your stuff thoroughly now look at that see I'm cutting that that whole top half gone so I'm gonna finish washing these and going I'm gonna finish going through these really good and then we go come over here to our snow crab and our king crab we just go wash these make sure it ain't nothing shady on these like this I don't do that see that right there with that right there no no ma'am no ham and then just let them soak let them soak too. Let them soak in some nice warm water. Did you see all that stuff floating? You don't want to eat that. So just, you know, wash it. Wash it up good. We letting our shrimp unthaw. With some nice cool water. Um, these, um, they say they are already uh, deveined. You always want to just, when they unthaw, you always just want to go in with a little extra split. Make sure they ain't play you. And make sure it ain't no dookie line in there. Just clean your stuff. So then, this is um, all the ingredients we are going to need for my little seafood butter sauce concoction. Because I'm so sad that I'm running so low. So low on my smackalicious. So low. I'm saving this. 
I'm saving this, y'all, for a personal. This gonna be for a personal boil for me. Don't tell nobody. Okay, so we gonna make us a nice seafood um butter today. Like I showed y'all earlier, we gonna use that healthy butter, okay? Cause we don't need no clogged arteries. It's bad enough that we eating all this stuff. We got us a little bit of beef broth. We got us some um, butter. We got us a whole yellow onion. We got that minced ginger, that minced garlic. We got some brown sugar. We got some um, lemon pepper parsley flakes. I think it's Old Bay and Slap Your Mama back here. And we is not using vanilla. I don't even know why this is out. You got to get back in there. I don't even know why you out. Why you tripping? Why you tripping? You ain't going in my boil. So yeah, so this is all for our sauce. So I will be back, you guys. Oh yeah, and I got my eggs. I put my eggs in first. And um, take those out, let those cool off. And what I like to do is like peel them and toss them back in the seasoned water. And you know, and then we just go drench it with some good butter sauce, y'all. Y'all know seafood boil, everybody doing it. It's going down. Okay, it's going down the Yaya's catering way, real light, no no lobster, no scallops, something real, real light tonight, y'all. So y'all stay tuned. Okay, you guys, here is our boil, that is our potatoes, our corn, and our sausage. So what are we, um, what we are about to add to that um, seasoned water is a, just a splash of beef broth, just for extra flavor. Um, now we are about to go in with our boiled, uh, where are you? Boiled and already peeled eggs. I like to put them back in the, um, seasoned water just so that flavor can infuse inside of that egg. So when you bite it, it's just full of flavor. Okay, so let's put that back in there and... We are also going in with our shrimp and our crab. We are going to have those at the very top so they can sting, not boil, but sting. It's going to be delicious. Push everything down. Push everything down there. There you go. And we are going to let everything steam up for about eight minutes. Let's put our lid back on. Let that do what it do. And that should be ready by the time our sauce is done, y'all. So I'll be back. All right, my YouTube family. I'm so right now, let's get started on our um seafood butter sauce there's no right way or no wrong way to have a sauce i know some people um like to keep it simple some people just like the butter and the garlic powder real easy let's keep it simple some people like all these extra ingredients shout out to be loved because I ain't know nothing about no onions and no sauce to dip in no seafood until she came out so shout out to her um so I'm about to do like a seafood sauce my way. Um, so we have our uh, yellow onion here. Okay, the pan is nice and hot. Those are already frying. So now I'm about to add in our four sticks of butter. Four sticks of butter. And again, like I showed y'all earlier, if anybody just wants to kind of choose a healthier route, um, I found this at my local grocery store. We are going to try this out. It is dairy free, made with olive oil, a plant um, based butter. Um, so it is not the healthiest, but is definitely healthier than a dairy butter. So we are definitely about to try out this country crock plant butter um, with our seafood. And we are adding in four sticks of this. So there's two. Two, 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 two. two. There's three. Get on out of there. Get on out of there. Get on out of there. 
And here is four. Boom, just like that. Okay, so we are going to let our butter melt and we are going to just cook this on or simmer this or not even boil simmer simmer this on low until our um, onions are nice and translucent and soft so once they are nice and translucent and soft or midway to that point we are going to come back and we are going to add in our seasonings and then we are going to let this sauce simmer some more. So I will be back y'all when those onions are midway through done. Okay fam, let's spice up this butter sauce. So we are going to start with our seasonings which is over here with me and I will show y'all in a minute. Okay, so y'all never see me use this. Guess what I'm using, y'all? A measuring spoon. Good night. So, we are using a tablespoon of each seasoning. This is a tablespoon of Slap Your Mama. Boom. And then we are going to go in with a tablespoon of lemon pepper. Lemon pepper seasoning. Boom. We are going in with some parsley. Boom. We are going to go in with the whole, oh, I don't want to spill it. We are going to go in with the entire jar of roasted garlic. I love garlic and seafood together. It just pairs, they, they supposed to be together. It's like the perfect couple, you know what I'm saying? They're supposed to be together. So let's add in the whole thing of roasted garlic. In you go. Boom. We are going to add in, not the whole thing of ginger, cause this stuff is a little spicy. So I am going to go in with I think I don't even think I'm gonna go in with a tablespoon of this, y'all. I think I'm gonna go in with like a a shaky, a shaky shake. Hold on, let me see. I gotta eyeball this. Hold on. I think I'm gonna go in with. Oh shucks. That's it. That's it for that. That's this some strong stuff. Okay. And then we are going to go in with some ground paprika. Tablespoon, one tablespoon, oh shit, two. Okay, let's give this a stir. And then what we are going to do is just let these flavors marry together. We're going to let this simmer probably for about five to seven minutes. And then it should be all done. Oh, you know what, y'all? What I forgot? Hold up. We also got to go in with some... I'm just kicking the camera all... My bad, y'all. I'm just kicking the camera all over the place. Get it together, sis. Okay, uh, we're going in with some light brown sugar. Not a lot of light brown sugar. Uh, we ain't even go. Yes, we is. Let's not sure. What's up, babe? So let's go in with a tablespoon. Booyah. That's all you need of that. That's all you need. Give it a nice stir. Nice little stir. Nice stir. And we gonna put the lid on this, y'all. 
and we see how them onions got nice and soft they just pair so good with the crab and the shrimp and the egg ain't nothing like a seafood boil it's nothing like it so let's let this continue boiling I'm gonna turn my seafood my seafood is over there steaming let me show y'all <laughs> so it's over here See, and in that big pot, it's over there steaming. So it's been steaming for about about five, about five to eight minutes. So I'm about to um, cut the fire off on that and just let the residual steam finish cooking that. And you can see our sauce is already boiling up. So let's get the lid on. And we gonna let this do what it do. And I'll be back, y'all. I think when I come back, it's time to show y'all like the finished product, like period. Like I know y'all waiting. So, be back. All right, my YouTube fam. Here is the finished product. Seafood boil, delicious, flavorful. Can't wait to dig in. America's favorite, a seafood boil. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Love you all so much. I appreciate you all for tuning in. Until the next time, YouTube family. Everybody stay safe and stay blessed.